help anybody bring food over. I mean, with love like that, it just spread from the top of the church throughout the church. Tell me, that, that's nothing but God. So I really appreciate it, and I love everyone here. And if you're ever in the D.C. area, you're more than welcome. I'm from Arkansas, and we open our doors. We don't just say come by. You can come by. I'm always ready. Okay? So thank you so much. I appreciate all the, the love and the work that went into tonight's celebration. Thank you, committee people. We'll talk later. Thank you. <laughs> faces, it's almost like you're, you're just loving pieces of a, of, of a quilt. You know, each one of you played a part, has played a part in our lives. Uh, when we, things were down, you know, with every life there's going to be times when you lose people. And you were always there with your comfort and your concern and your love and your hugs. If you didn't have anything to say, just, to, just the hugs were there. And then the happy times, the celebrations, the the weddings and the, the, the birth of grandchildren and the christenings, and you were there for that. So you've been there for us through all these years, and we just want to say thank you. And we're so happy and to be able to look at each one of you face to face before we move here and, and to tell you how much we love you, how much we appreciate you, and how much we're going to miss you. Uh, the little haiku poem, uh, Jason pirated. <laughs> I wrote for this occasion, so it's just on the little piece of paper on your on your table. I hope you'll just keep it as a as a keepsake uh, of us. And it is just uh, what is left to say, except thank you. We love you. We will pray for you. So God bless you all. We just love you with all our hearts.